Hello everyone. We have one of the stars of Midnight Texas, Jason Lewis, joining us today to talk more about the show, which by the way, airs here on NBC tonight at nine o'clock. This is this is an intense show. Yes. Tell, tell us more about it. Um well, you know, it's just your typical everyday average town, middle of nowhere stuff. With zombies. Stuff. Well, no, <laughs> no we zombies? don't have so much no. zombies. Okay. We do definitely have uh, the undead. We have vampires, a, a female assassin. We got some witches in there, some demons, a psychic, an angel. And you play an angel. I play an angel. So tell us more about your character. Um, Joe Strong, like a lot of the characters, we're, uh, we're hiding out in midnight as a refuge against a world that's, you know, maybe unaccepting or persecuting and uh i also have a deep dark secret oh yeah uh that do we know that yet though? no you don't oh, get we'll to see out. what that is until later on uh so that's why i just got to you know raise an eyebrow and go deep dark secret mm -hmm. um but it's it's a fun show it's viscerally entertaining because of all how could you not be viscerally entertaining with vampires and witches and demons and stuff mm -hmm. but it's also just, I love the writing in it. It's, for me, the, my favorite part about it is the, I, the notion that's throughout that family is often found. You sometimes don't get what you need right in front of you, and that doesn't mean you won't find what you need if you just go out there and look for it. And a lot of people know you from Sex and the City, mm -hmm. but boy, is this a completely different character. A little different, from that show, yeah. Correct? Yeah, well, he's a little less naive. You can't be after that long. Um, yeah, yeah. Uh, I don't think I killed anybody in Sex in the City. Not that I recall. Yeah, that was a more friendly family show. Right, with a right. More sex. This is, yeah. So, so this character though uh, does kill people. I mean, how how would you describe? Well, I would say you know, uh, there's a slogan for midnight: outsiders are welcome. Um, the addendum to that being just don't step on anybody's toes. You're bound to get eaten. So we're. We're a fierce family. We've, we've retreated for our own sanctuary. So everyone's welcome to come into our town. Just don't threaten us. If you threaten us, you get the whole family. Where do you guys shoot this? Albuquerque, New Mexico. And how has that been? I loved it. I, I, I loved uh, discovering New Mexico. It was cold. We're shooting an overnight show sometimes. It's 17 degrees out. You don't have a shirt on. It, it you know, brings that pain to the scene for you. Yeah. Um, but I loved it. It was... It was such a raw open space a uh, lot of discovery for me like my, one of my favorite parts was going to the Indian ruins and I just like the mindset there a lot of young very curious people so. how do you physically prepare for a role like this <sighs> um, sit-ups <laughs> no I mean sit-ups and chicken breast yeah you know, <laughs> no no I like to eat and drink a glass of wine now and then um, physically Honestly, uh, it wasn't so demanding. I had CGI wings. Uh, I was more trying to figure out where the hell my mind would be. Uh, this guy's been around for 2,000 years, and I was like, what, or, or longer. I haven't quite been informed. Mm -hmm. um, and what does that really entail? And I, I started thinking about it, and I just put it in context for any of us, is that you know, as we go through life, we have so many hits, and it's hard to keep your cynicism at bay and what he must have struggled with over all this time seeing humanity's depravity, but also seeing that we are capable of such exquisite uh, kindnesses. And, and, and uh, so I, I sort of started with one of those history of the world type things where everything happens in the last few seconds of the timeline billion years before. And I just looked at the main key events in human history and started writing little stories about it. Like when's the first time I met a human and what was that like? Uh, and sort of connected from so, there. So that was some of your preparation there as well? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. So again, it airs tonight at 9 p.m. Midnight Texas right here on NBC. Thank you so much for being with us. Pleasure. It's a fascinating show. Intense, but fascinating. Yeah, I think right. a little something for everybody. You know, if you like your down home cooking, we have that. And if you like your eviscerations and goriness, we have that. So it's got everything. Yeah. Thanks. What could you ask for? It's Thanks a blender. Thanks for being here with us today. <laughs> Pleasure. Thank you. It was really lovely.